Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And today, you know what I'm saying? We got some more lovely females to talk about, man, as usual, you know. Without further ado, let's just hop right into this. Today I learned that women hit the wall at 35 years old. So I'm about to hit the wall next year? Never in a million years I imagine myself being single in my 40s. Never in a million years I imagine it was going to be so hard to find someday. We got to dig our fucking guts. Yo. Like. My question is, or my thought process is, what made you. Well, I can kind of guess at this point. The reason why she's lonely, because. I'm just going to go ahead and just flat out and say that. I mean, wow, I was not expecting her. That was a real reaction y'all saw right there just then from me. Because I really was like not expecting her to say that. Feel sorry for her. Nah, let me stop lying. No, I don't. Because she's probably that woman that was probably, you know, uh, really picky and uh probably controlling and uh that's why she lonely because she picky and she's controlling or the guys that she did have she was either too controlling too picky and uh people dudes just wasn't dealing with that so now she what 40 and now she's saying she having some trouble finding some deep well Good luck. <laughs> Man. Tom, that's crazy. You see my fucking butts. I am way too young and way too hot to be working 8 to 5. I'm getting a sugar daddy. And at this point, you can get all the sugar he wants. Alexa, remind me that I don't need a man. Yeah, you do. What? Bro, this is what I'm talking about with these modern day females, bro. She is talking to her phone. Asking her phone to remind her that she doesn't need a man. In all actual reality, if she's doing that, she's in denial and she's delusional. Because she's in denial that she needs a man. So she's sitting up there trying to make herself believe the total opposite that she doesn't need a man. But like I said, y'all, like I said in yesterday's video, you know, about these other females and the crazy stuff that they were saying and doing. This is what we dealing with. She's literally telling herself that she doesn't need a man. In all actual reality, she really wants one. But she can't get one. Because this is what's wrong with her. She crazy. Y'all can see it in this clip. She literally speaking to Siri or her phone or what her iPhone or whatever phone she got talking about to remind her that she doesn't need a man. But she's delusional, but she really wants one, though. Every damn day. Uh, so is our nice guys. Why? Because they love her. Man. <laughs> she wants... Okay, 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 okay. I don't think that has anything to do with somebody's doing the do skills to a female. I don't think that has anything to do with what, like, does that even make any logical sense? What does that mean? What, what does, oh, a nice guy can't elf me because he's too nice. He can't do the do to me because he's too nice. Bro, that's so stupid. That shouldn't have nut, bro. What does having a what what I mean? What is being a nice guy versus being a a a, a, a scumbag have to do with sex sexual skills? I mean, because I'm pretty sure a good guy can have some skill too. You you never know. So how can one person one female say, "Oh no, forget." The nice guys, they don't know how to, they don't know how to do the do. You know what I'm saying? I need a, I need a, I need a jerk, you know, because they know how to do it. Bro, that, I'm pretty sure there's plenty of nice dudes 
you might be surprised if females will give the nice dudes a chance. You might just be surprised that some of us got some skill. Probably better than the jerks that you think that got all the skill. Like, I just don't get that. Just, man, so quick to write the nice dude off. So quick to write, just write them and erase them and write them off. You know what I'm saying? But I think that was stupid. That was a dumb... That that was dumb. Parker, I don't really care about money. I like a guy who's happy. I don't really care about his credit score. Oh, shut up. What? Okay, do you think sex is a duty of marriage? No, I think sex is a duty of marriage. Okay, so no, no, yes. What about, yeah. Yes. 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 Because I, I would say, like, if, you, if he's married and he's protecting and providing, why, why would you not give him sex? No, I'm not saying. Like, wait, we're talking. Okay. I'm not giving him sex. It's just like it shouldn't be a duty. It shouldn't be like. Okay, if you don't. Listen, man. I don't get. I, I just don't get this. Why does it always got to be one female? Why do you feel. Okay, listen. It shouldn't be a duty. It should be something that you feel or urge. Something that just happens naturally. Who is who is making it a duty? Or why is she making it seem like the man is making it a duty for her to, to do the do? It should be something that that the, a feeling that happens naturally. And then y'all should just do it naturally. It should be a feeling, a mutual feeling that happens naturally. And y'all both should want to do it naturally. It shouldn't be like, oh, I got to go do the do with this person. Like, like she making it seem like it's a chore. Now, if it's coming down to that, then I don't know. Maybe it's you. Because a guy is not going to sit there and make it no chore. It's just supposed to happen naturally. Like one night, you know, y'all, it's a mutual feeling. Y'all both feeling the feeling and then y'all just do the do. It's just, it's just supposed to happen naturally. But if you may, if it's coming down to a point to where it's a chore, she turned it in. She made it that way because she started to feel that way. There is no way no dude is going to make this a chore or make this doing the do. That's something us guys love to do with a female is doing the do. Correct. So why the hell are we going to make her feel like it's a chore? Unless she started to feel like it's a chore and she turned it into that feeling because her thought process because ain't no guy finna mess that up we not finna mess that up because that's something we trying to get so why the hell we gonna try to mess that up so we can't get it no more that don't make no sense for no guy we not trying to mess that up if, if you I'll give it to you but you can't force me well, I want ownership. But see, that, that's like a lack of submission, though. Uh, because, because if you're submissive, you just say, okay, yeah. Ain't nobody, man, listen, bro. Ain't nobody trying to force nothing. Uh, nobody wants to date me. I want to date you. I find you really attractive, and I think that we should go out. Go away. Why do women often choose to make lists? Do I go with this good first or next potatoes? You know what? <laughs> My bad about the ass, y'all. I think I could skip it. But I wanted, to, I wanted to say something. In that last clip, I think she was doing like a TikTok or whatever. But when a guy started to compliment her, that's usually how it goes. You know what I'm saying? For real. Like you start, like you start being nice. The moment you start being nice and giving out, you know, compliments that a female should get and receive and should want and like, they automatically. You know, as soon as you start that compliment and being nice crap, uh, get away from me, uh, they curve you. You get a curveball thrown at you. I'm in a relationship rather than what they bring to the table. Because they're demanding and they think that they're the shit. Well, we are. We are. We are. We're in power. We, what? We are. We, we're the ones that get to the ice street. No, no, no. I think the guys should be the ones showing what they bring to the table. The women should... See, that's that's what I don't like. That's that ish I don't like. Why should see some of these modern girls, females, whatever? 
They say one thing like it's a one way street. This is a two way street conversation. I don't get this one way street or this one track mind process that these modern females have. A one track mind process. Yo, whatever. Like they just said, oh, I think a man should uh, uh, show what they're bringing to my table. Or, no, no, no. It's nobody's table. It's just a table. How about that? So, and then it's like, how can you say that and a guy can't get on a clip and say the same dang on thing? It should be the same thing for them. If I'm going to be in a relationship, how about we both show each other what we bring into this table? Why should the dude have to show and then the female just, sit, just oh, I ain't got to do nothing. I ain't got to show nothing. I think some of these, most of these modern females should stop saying these one, or they saying like it's a one way conversation and it's really a two way. It's a two way because you need to show what you bring into the table, not just your body. And then, you know, some of them be like, I am a table, which is ridiculous. I, I don't get that. No, you're not the table. If I got to show, if I got to show something, you got to show something. Because I don't want to be with somebody that just want to look pretty. That's all I'm going to say. You're going to have to show me what can you hold the weight. Because in, in a relationship, if you want me to hold my weight. Baby girl, you got to hold your way. And I'm going to end the video on that. You know what I'm saying? Y'all let me know if y'all like today's video and some of the uh, things I was talking about and reacting to and giving my thoughts to in the video today. Hit that notification bell. Like I said, I'm going to be here every day uploading, reacting, giving my thoughts. And thank you again uh, to everybody that subscribed. I'm going to literally be thanking y'all. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate it each and every last one of y'all for subscribing to this channel um and for all the new people in advance that stumble across this channel and give me a chance and decide to hit the subscribe button thank you all in advance and into the next video i'll see y'all real soon peace